so happy to be talking to a camera again. <laughs> as silly as that may sound. I'm officially one week and one day postpartum with my sweet little bubs. And I honestly just like miss creating. I miss working. I started my maternity leave like before he even came. And um, I'm just, quite frankly, I'm ready to get back to it. He has been the most chill baby you know he's been very very easy which is great naps a ton really only gets fussy if he needs his diaper changed or if he needs food and even then like he doesn't have big cries like I don't know he's a very very ch chill boy and I have spent most of my time just puzzling and watching Disney movies my mom is here with me right now so we've just been hanging out. We've been doing an outing every other day to get ourselves out of the house, to get him out of the house, and yeah, everything is good so far, which is great. Poppy girl, you are looped up in the funniest of ways. Um, I don't even know if I can help you here, dog. Oh, and now she's gonna go on the other side of me again. <laughs> it's a mess. I ended up having a package sitting by my mailbox, which I really don't like Actually, that's the first time that's ever happened here where they've dropped a package off at the mailbox because it's like, then I don't know that I have a package. Oh, I think this is from my... <laughs> Hold on. It's from my financial advisors. Poppy, you want to smell? Ma'am. Poppy and I are out on a little adventure right now. This is my last trip out of the house without my little man. And quite frankly, a very long time. I don't know the next time I'm gonna be able to sneak out without him. So I figured, well, actually my mom was really sweet. Yesterday she offered, she was like, while you have someone here, why don't you like go to a coffee shop or something with Cameron, work a little, like do whatever you wanna do. And I was like, you know what would actually be really nice is if I could take this one to get her nails trimmed because honestly, just like far easier, just me taking her without him. Obviously with him, like it wouldn't be that big of a deal, but it's just like definitely easier. So since she offered, I was like, game on, let's do it. So you guys, bullet coffee. <laughs> so happy right now. They, um, I asked them if they had any like dog treats or anything to give Poppy a little something after she got her nails trimmed and they just put like whipped cream in this one. <laughs> so Poppy had that and I have got my matcha. This is great. So one week postpartum check-in. Not all of my YouTube videos are going to be about motherhood. I feel like I'm like really invigorated. Like it just today getting all the clips and stuff that I was getting, I was like, oh my gosh, this is so fun because my life feels new and fresh and like I can share different things compared to I feel like my days are just the exact same every single day and I'm sure I'm gonna get into that routine here soon with him but I'm like for so long like I was just sharing with you guys the same stuff over and over again and now it's like I have something totally different in my life that I get to share with you so it's been kind of fun vlogging today and I honestly I just I miss work I was talking to my man yesterday about how I'm just like, I'm so ready to not be relaxing anymore, which might be crazy. <laughs> and I understand, but I think it's because my bubble man, he is so incredibly chill. Even this morning when I was talking to my mom, she was like, you guys must have had a really good night. Like I didn't hear you at all. And I was like, oh no, we were up for like two hours at one point And then he was up every other hour. Which, like, isn't a big deal, but he's just not a whaler, at least not yet. I am able to catch him. I, like, I am a light enough sleeper that I'm able to catch him when he's starting to get a little unsettled before he's at the point of, like, oh my gosh, I need to eat, or oh my gosh, I'm miserable in this diaper. Like, I'm able to catch him really early on, so, like, he does not whale. He's very easy to soothe, and it's just been... 
really, really easy. I don't know. Like, it, it just has been. So, I am at the point now where I'm like, okay, I've spent a whole week just, like, puzzling, watching movies, chilling out. And sure, like, every single day I'm doing laundry and I'm washing bottles and I'm taking care of him and there's, like, more on my plate. But at the same time, like, when he's napping, he naps for a solid two, three hours. And I'm like, I could be working right now. Like, I could be editing right now. And I'm trying to still, like, take it easy. But, like, even in my body, like, I feel so incredibly good. And I'm not sure what I was expecting postpartum, but, like, I just, I feel great. And I, yeah, <laughs> I have no other words. But when I was talking to my man about this, he was like, Kevin, enjoy this time because he's going to get to a point where, like, his wake windows are longer, he's going to be more active, he's going to be running around the house, all that stuff. And I'm like, that's fine. Because then, like, I'll be entertained and I'll be occupied with him. But I am so much so my dad's daughter in the sense that, like, I always need to be doing something. Like, I need to be busy. I need to be doing something. That's how I thrive. And I just feel like right now I'm not doing anything. So, like, when he's at that phase, like, I'm going to be so excited, like, coming up with activities for him to do and all of that. Like, it's, it's going to be so much fun. But I'm like, right now he's just napping. So there's, like, nothing for me to do <laughs> this time. So... Here I am. He's currently napping at home right now. Um, probably got our nails trimmed. I'm drinking my matcha. And I'm chatting with you guys. And then otherwise, you guys, the kitchen. So countertops should be going in within the next few weeks. They've actually arrived at the fabricator and I sent them all the information. I actually ordered my sink and I ordered my water filter guy and... I sent them all the information that they need to like start the cuts. I am just gonna do a walkthrough with them of the finalized template and placement of cuts because specifically there's one corner in the kitchen where three cuts are going to meet. It's the corner where the sink is, you guys know, so if you're looking at my kitchen, like the far left corner, so there's gonna be one cut coming in this way, one cut coming in this way, and then it's also the backsplash as well. And that's like my primary concern everything else should flow like I mean the island is just like one whole freaking slab in and of itself the bar area is just one thing and then it's like section uh sink and then that weird area and then it's like pretty straight so it, it's really it's just that one corner that I want to see to make sure that it's gonna look as good as possible and then I want to look into new cabinet pools because if you guys remember well over a freaking year ago at this point I shared like what cabinet pools I was thinking for the kitchen but that was like before the kitchen was really designed and the pools that I have are too small like I need large grand pools for the pantry door specifically and I just need to like go back to the drawing board I was trying to be a little bit cheap and buy them off of Amazon and now that I'm like really thinking about it um I I can't do that I just didn't want to spend like a couple hundred dollars on cabinet pools but I need to it's just like what's gonna really look best for the kitchen so I gotta figure out that and then actually the trim work still needs to be finished in the kitchen before the cabinets can be stained and stuff so the countertop is going in before the cabinets are stained in case you guys wanted a random update there the bathroom I still need to get towel hooks the mirror needs hung I gotta do the ceiling and all of that. I mean, I just, like, haven't done any house projects since, like, what you guys saw of the master bedroom makeover. So, that's where we're at. With life, with baby, with house, and kind of with work. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, I am hosting a retreat January 2024. We can talk about that in another YouTube video. But, if you guys want to come to the retreat, reserve your spot because it's very, very limited. And that is it. I need to go home to my little baby and puzzle. Um, my mom has not seen a lot of Disney movies, which just blows me away. But she's like, ever since you guys are kids, like I just haven't like seen. I'm like, how? Disney is my favorite. <laughs> and I'm obsessed with Disney movies. So she has never seen Moana. So Moana is on today's list. I. I showed her like a whole bunch of other ones we've been like working our way through I'm like have you seen this one have you seen this one have you seen this one because you got like you got to see these so we've just been working our way through Disney movies and working our way through puzzles which is honestly like not a bad thing at all this was a nice nice chat
Fuck you guys, I need to shut up.